Hi everyone, I'm Thomas Pesquet uh, and I'm an astronaut living on board the International Space Station. Hey Paxi, do you know what microbes are? Microbes, they're also known as microorganisms. They're tiny living things that are found all around us. They're too small to be seen with the naked eye, but they can be seen using a microscope. So where can you find microbes? Well, microbes really do live everywhere, including in water, soil, and in the air. The human body is in fact home to trillions of microbes. So wherever we go, microbes will follow, and that includes the International Space Station. The most common types of microbes are bacteria, viruses, and fungi. Bacteria, they're single cell microbes that are mostly harmless to humans. For example, there are bacteria inside the gut that help us digest our food, and there are other types that help the immune system fight germs. Viruses, they're not technically living cells. They're made up of genetic material, like DNA, surrounded by a protective shell. Viruses, they envelop healthy living cells and reprogram them in order to duplicate themselves. That is how a viral infection spreads. Some viruses are harmless or even helpful for our bodies, but others, like coronavirus, can make us very ill. Fungi are found in many different places on Earth. You probably even have some in your kitchen right now. The most well-known ones are mold, yeast, which is used to make bread, and mushrooms. Lots of fungi are friendly and are found on the human body, but a few types can cause diseases in humans, such as athlete's foot. So, Paxi, the types of microbes found on the International Space Station are mainly ones that come from the human body. The ISS is a different environment than Earth, so the microbes we bring with us can behave very differently here. For example, you might have noticed that I'm floating because here on the ISS, we experience microgravity. We've noticed that microbes in microgravity can change and grow faster than they would on Earth. That makes it easier for us to study them and the medicines that can be used to treat them and to fight against them. Another big difference is how microbes respond to different surfaces. We have recently learned that some microbes, especially fungi, love to hang out and grow around technology and on metal surfaces, which can be a problem here where we're surrounded by both. This can even be dangerous because the microbes can break down and harm our equipment. So how do we keep these microbes under control? Well, because the ISS is an enclosed ecosystem, where we recycle all the air and water, we have special machines that can filter the air we breathe and produce water that is very safe for the astronauts to use. We also regularly, in fact, every Saturday, clean the space station with a vacuum cleaner, and then we wipe down all the surfaces and try to keep everything dry, just like you would do at home. And finally, we make sure that all of the cargo and equipment that comes up to station is clean before we pack it for launch and that our crew are healthy before they arrive. It's important to keep your home clean and healthy, especially if it's in space. So see you next time, Paxi. Bye-bye.